Why we're already over the moon for Tonikawa? Tonikawa over the moon for you. Promises keeps our adorableness. Right there in the title, Tonikawa is short for Tonikako Kawaii. In a kawaii-ness, the title looks like, looks like it's going to carry over the multiple parts of the, of the show. The popular manga is becoming an anime this autumn, and we're totally ready for all the adorable. The hero of, of our piece is Nasa, a boy with a strange name, whose life is saved by a girl named Sokasa. He asks her out, and she asks, and she yes. On the condition that he marries her, three years later she returns with all the necessary paperwork, and their married life begins. Here's just a few reasons why we can wait. We, we can wait for the series to start. It's from the creator Hayate Takuma Butler. The name Tenshiro Hata might not be immediately familiar to everyone, but the title Hayate Takuma Butler likely rings a bell, right? The over-the-top rom-com about a high schooler working as butler and bodyguard. To a young otaku won over fans worldwide, the event got a live action adaptation. The original Hayate manga ran from 2004 to 2017, with Tonikawa starting to 2018. Hata has done a great job in the past bringing a cute, heartfelt romances with an unexpected twist, so we can wait to see what its current series has in store. The leading lady is full of mystery. Sokasa Sokoyomi, later Yuzaki, is often compared to the mythical mythical character of Princess Kaguya, a baby fan and a bamboo shoot who grew to adulthood in three months' time, and after rejecting multiple suitors, including the Emperor, eventually revealed she came from the moon and would have to return before long. We didn't know how much know much about Sokasa at all, but the parallels are interesting, including her three-year absence from Anasa, which could be a reference to the three years Princess Kaguya spent communicating via letters with the Emperor. It's probably been a while until we got any solid answers, as the Tonikawa manga is still running. We were looking forward to forming the theories. We need a little cuteness anyway. All signs point to Tony Kawa over the moon for you being a big shot of romance and we're here for it. It'd be fun to watch a show about the involving relationship rather than waiting to see whether there's a relationship in the first place. And Nasa seems like a sweet guy too. We want good things for him.